view from above the area. As you can see, this gives us a better scope of the impact of that flooding. We sent SkyDro 9 to the Deer Run Road area just northeast of Trinity to give you a better idea of where this is. This is an area between Highway 94 and the tributaries running into Lake Livingston. While the homes built on stilts, they are getting by better. Some ground level homes are currently submerged in as much as a couple feet of water. Officials have shared at this time. Yes, Nomi. I'm I'm here at Deer Run Road here in Trinity, where a mandatory evacuation is in place due to the high level of flooding you see behind me. Now, some of this is a little bit out of frame, but you can see that the water is so high that it's almost covering the tires of some of the cars out here. It's also covering some small trees. Before we started, there were some people kayaking, actually, and these are some of the people that have stayed despite the mandatory evacuation notice. Now, Trinity County Sheriff Woody Wallace says that they did evacuate 14 people from this area, but some people did stay. But he said he did get confirmation from them that they either had a way out or would wait it out in case it got any worse. Now, Now, if you're in two and three foot of water with power still on and that water's over the electrical plugs, how we didn't have electrocutions, I'll never know. Yeah, so if you drive by Highway 94, which is in front of me, you might mistake this deer run subdivision for a lake in itself. The water is just that high right now. Uh, as I said before, there is some water that is rising pretty high. You see some of the people that stayed behind from the evacuation here now. And you see him here, he's towing his kayak. So some people, like I said, did stay despite that mandatory evacuation. But like Sheriff Woody Wallace said, they did have a way out or they were going to wait it out. In Trinity County, I'm Terry White. Back to you. Terry, thank you so much. Of course, our thoughts and prayers are with everyone who evacuated and also decided to stay.